Sports Squire here with the Tegan Van Guns from Georgia Tech Volleyball. Team's coming off of a good weekend uh, set of victories here in your arena. Syracuse specifically on Sunday, 3-0. to zero. What did the team do well in that performance to earn the win? Um, I think we just stayed together as a team really well. They pushed us in some of the sets. I mean, we knew it was going to be a battle going into the game, so it was just staying mentally tough, um, knowing that they're going to get their kills, but knowing that as long as we control our side of the court and, and win the ball control game, that we're going to come out victorious, which is what we did. I went to the match, and I was noticing the usually the outsides are a big offensive option for you, but a lot of middle situations as well, or hitting it towards the middle. Was there something that you saw in the scouting report or in their film that you saw that there would be some openings there? Yeah, that was one of the things that we had talked about. We knew that their pin blockers kind of dropped their hands. Um, as I said, I was getting the ball, so that was one of the things that we wanted to attack, um, knowing that our middles would have a single block pretty much every time. So yeah, that was part of the game plan and it executed well. And another double double for you. We, we, we talked some statistically. We talked so much about your kills and you're among the conference leaders in that regard. But also with the digs. And we spoke earlier in the year about you taking pride in being a two kind of a two way player as far as your digs. What does these double doubles mean for you? Just showing your ability to defend as well as being an offensive force. Yeah, and I think it also goes into our blocking. Um, has been pretty well this season too. So they're just. I mean, the ball's coming right at us a lot of the times, which is a testament to what our block is doing. Um, but like you said, I, take, I do take pride in, on the defensive side of the game too, um, not just offensively because we need, we need both of them to, to win. So, yeah, still good. Yeah, team started off the one and two in conference, but now you've won five straight matches in ACC play. What's been the difference in the play for the team to have these victories? Um, I think we have a lot more confidence in what we're doing. Um, coming into the gym every day and working hard um, and knowing that we can beat teams I think is a big thing the mentality that we have going into games um, is a lot more positive and and knowing that we can win um, so that's definitely something that we've grown in the past couple of weeks and just even the losses that we did have just fighting for it um, is really something that we can see this year better than past years have been. Yeah, you had a teammate, London Ackerman, set a career mark in for Georgia Tech in digs. Uh, discuss helping her reach that mark, or and just you came in together as as, as freshmen, and just dip your path together. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's a big part of our defense and what we do both passing and defensively. So that's a huge milestone for her, and I know that she's super proud of herself, and all of our teammates are super proud of her too. Um, but we still got some more games to play, so she's going to keep up in that number. So that's exciting. Good. Speaking of these matches, you have two coming up against Wake Forest and Duke in North Carolina. Yeah. Teams that are right in your vicinity as far as record goes in conference. Uh, what's the team working on this week in practice to prepare for these contests? Yeah, both of these teams have been playing well, especially at home. Uh, so they're going to be big tests for us this weekend going on the road. Um, and we're just working hard, keeping keeping the focus on our side of the net and what we can do to better each ball um, and put ourselves in the best position to win. Uh, we haven't really started scouting too much, um, or at least the coaches haven't um, showed that to us yet. So that'll be in the next couple of days. We'll start looking at the teams, but these first couple of days of practice this week are just still working on our side of the net and what we're gonna do to, to win.